one blast off hello 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 welcome to space engineers on the xbox on the series x quick one for you this morning a mod showcase one i've wanted to do for a while that i've been using for a while and is part of se modders for rather eclectic mix of uploads and this is the cult command console pack if you're building ships or stations and you want something a little bit more um, impressive than the vanilla console packs then you can use this one i use this one on the callisto 71 and it's a pretty great pack this will be a short one so first of all let's go through what you get with the command console pack it's a large grid pack and so starting with a console main straight version switch on a stand an inverted version for against walls a wall switch a main console with a chair a cockpit console with chair cockpit console with a display a cockpit console with hood a ceiling monitor a second ceiling monitor curved console which you can fit together and a short version which you can also fit together that's what you get so what have we got then well you have usually a main display where you can access your control panel and you have buttons which are usually four set these up like you would any other regular button panel press x find a group like i've done here and that's it Moving on to this one, same deal. Access your control panel, four buttons. And as you can see, these are very nice panels. You can set up actions, just like normal panels moving on to single switch. Same deal, it has one switch, so Good for maybe a single door that opens and closes. Very easy to set up. One of my favorite doors is of course the sliding door. with this yeah yeah nice little compact switch and then lovely little wall switch as well different kind of way to open and close doors cult command console pack provides then you have your main console good for a command ship great on a bridge
this can be used to control a ship as well. It makes a good uh, co-pilot control. And of course, you've got this one. Um, it's always a bit tricky with some of these. There it is. Uh, you'd think to aim at the chair, but actually you have to aim at the console cockpit. Same deal. It's another control seat. Same as this one. And this one. Only this one comes with a display. Yeah. This one. Just a nice different design if you're going to have a command bridge. And these, of course, are just different style consoles. Useful for decoration on the sides. And then these come, of course. You can link them together with the other console blocks to make a station like this. And then there's this one, which you can use. Make a nice little... Station here. You have a six button station, <coughs> quite compact. Good for engineering or something like that, or maybe even a medical. And that is the Alt Command Console Pack. I'll leave the link in the description. You've also got these up here. I've forgotten those briefly, but they are range of monitors again good for a bridge just to add a little bit more detail to your starship work very well with the other terminal star blocks um, like the animated control consoles that I showed off many moons ago now it seems and yeah there you go SE Modder 4 once again um, I've been wanting to do this one as I said for a while and I will be looking back through some of the other mods as well that I've been using that I haven't yet showcased there have been a few that I just use as a matter of fact but I'd be interested to see what you do with these or what you have done with them if you've got a really cool ship link it in my community tab or you know mention it in a comment and you never know, I might actually um, use it as one of the first ships I take a look at because I'm going to be looking at ships. I am going to be looking at builds um, fairly soon. I have the playlist all ready to go on YouTube. And uh, I just wanted to reach out as well and thank everyone for watching the channel, um, for liking and subscribing. Obviously, if you subscribe, then you help me out. You help the channel out. And I can do what I do. And I'll be doing even more. We will be going back to Earth-like on my new player guide. And <clears throat> I'm going to do uh, perhaps a recap and a little tutorial video. Since I've seen a bunch of people asking elsewhere, including um, privately. Some people have reached out to me um, who watch my channel, who play Space Engineers about the closed oxygen system that I used on the Callisto 71 to make the airlock. So I'll be doing an actual simple airlock build tutorial for new players and veteran players who may not have thought of doing what I was doing, which is making a closed system airlock. I showed you how to convert the red ship from the red ship map to a closed system airlock but not how to build one yourself this will also include the auto closing doors trick so stay tuned for that one 
hopefully you've enjoyed this video uh, continue to support the channel and me i'll catch you on the flip side stay safe take care have fun enjoy the game happy engineering look out for news i would say um i can't say when but i'm hoping we'll see some soon on potentially warfare 2 i'm looking forward to that i was impressed with what they did on warfare 1 and the rebalance to all the weapons and the new animations and even the new blocks and if you didn't know they did add new blocks to the dlc pack three new ones um so there you go bye for now